welcome, 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 welcome. Oh, yes. Hello, Professor Caddo, or should I say Department Chair Caddo, <laughs> and thanks for agreeing to this interview with the Elven Times. Oh, you're very welcome, uh, Miss Finney. Your request, well, uh, I can't say respect. It was the most courteous of all the respect of Christ's, yes. <laughs> of course. You, uh, you deserve that much, at least. Um, so let's get started. First of all, congratulations on your recent chairing of the Geomancy Department. I guess, to get the world turning, the Sahas Lexicon defines Geomancy as the auspicious placement of buildings and earthen structures. As the chair, what are your thoughts on the matter? Perhaps in a time before or such a description could have sufficed, but nowadays, geomancy is a fully-fledged field of thaumatological Any research. Any thoughts of the uh, recent comments by the Tribune that the yes. only reason you got your position as chair is due to geomancy being glorified civil engineering? <laughs> now look here, I got this position based on my credentials, credentials that your academy approved. Now, I don't know what's going on here, but it's clear you got this interview under false pretenses. Chair Caddo, how do you respond to detractors saying that your credentials were obtained in the blink of an elvish eye? And furthermore, the sheer absurdity of a chair teaching undergraduates who have been studying for longer than he has been alive. <laughs> now look here, you little shit. Glorified civil engineering? <laughs> Why don't I build a house under your house and I'll blow it sky high, so high the angels of retribution themselves couldn't go up and grab it and bring it back down. <laughs> auspicious placement? I'll give you auspicious placement. How about I auspiciously place magma under every step you take? Now get out of my office before I blow you, I geomantically explode you to the moon! Hi guys, and that was my Genesis Battle of Champions origin set spoiler video. Hopefully you had about one-tenth the fun, at least, that I did in making that. Poor Caddo, uh, now that he's uh, gotten older and showing his age, not really getting the love at the Elven Academy that he did in his youth as a, you know, up-and-coming hotshot professor. But let's get into the card. So we've got Geomantic Explosions. It is an 8G Thymos Angelara affiliated card. We've got forward, left, right, and back awareness, so all adjacent spaces, and it's an earth spell. Our first ability is a cast ability at swift speed for 32 aura. You deal six earth damage to everything in geomantic explosions as awareness. And then additionally, a little bit of gravy on top, we've got that earth brand trigger, uh, which is whenever anything is dealt damage by geomantic explosions without earth weakness, they gain earth weakness for this round. In terms of utility, I think this is going to be a great limited card, but for constructed play, I kind of, despite the high aura cost, it does feel a little bit to me like a fighter main board, just a versatile piece that then can be sideboarded or fourth ordered out in your second or third game just to have the specific answers you need. Like this will clear summons out the way. If you get attacked from almost any direction, you're going to be able to counterattack and probably kill what's attacking you if it's a summon. And then six damage is just like a reasonable amount of damage. The Earth Brand almost feels like a little bit of a trap because I don't think I want to open with a 32 aura spell. I kind of feel like I want to get my guarantee I'm getting my value out of it. Uh, but it's also just like great if you need it. Um, and then Essa will love this because it's more Earth damage if you've seen Essa, one of the new champions in the next set. But anyway, that's my card. Hopefully you enjoy the video. And of course, I can't go without saying a huge thank you to Haunted Castle Gaming for the spoiler and letting me bring it to you guys. Peace.